now listening to the sounds of Shine Right Productions. There we go. So people out in the world should be able to hear us. Just give it another minute or so. Yep, somebody turned the sound down yet. Mm. <laughs> that was me. Okay, cool, cool. Let's see, we got enough people in the house. Okay, so we'll go ahead and just get us started. So welcome everybody. My name is Keith from Shine Rock Productions representing DPU. And tonight is another battle night. So out of the first round so far, we've got uh, down to where this is the first round in the lower bracket. And we have Merck Valentine and Frankie Braggadocio facing off. So they gotta go big or go home. Whoever wins goes into the next round. So Without further ado, let's go ahead and introduce everybody in the house. We got CMU Beats, Mr. Frank Braggadocio himself, DJ Clientel, King QT, Demetrius Hawkins, Emmanuel Sonico, aka J Peso in the tuck, Benito Luciano, Mike Britton, and always hanging out with us in the cut is uh, Miss Asia, the writer. So the rules for tonight are pretty simple. Uh, with this one being an elimination round, there's three beats each person, um, maximum of three minutes, 30 seconds. And the on this side, we actually have uh, the panel actually send in their scores who won directly to Mr. Demetrius Hawkins privately. Of course, we always encourage participation. Uh, from the audience. So feel free to go ahead and, you know, say, hey, you know, at the end of the round, who you felt actually won that round. Those will be read, and I will acknowledge those in the audience also. So let's go ahead and get this thing kicked off. It was already decided that Merck Valentine was going to go first. So round one is Do You Hear Me? Here we go.
Okay, Merc, kicking off round one. So let me take a moment to actually acknowledge some of the people in the building. So we have Ana Helene in the spirit. We have Carla Lee. Thank y'all for joining. We got JB the General, Imani Dirty, and Mo Official. Definitely appreciate appreciate y'all rolling up and actually dropping the comments. So I think Merc is repping his set right now. So that's what's up. So we got to go ahead and give Frankie the opportunity to go ahead and fight back. So here we are, round one, Frankie Braggadocio with Fighting Spirit. This should be interesting. Let's go. Now for something completely different. concludes round one so i put the titles inside of the comments just so you guys actually know what you were listening to and from which producer so here is what i'm asking for everyone actually in the audience go ahead and actually drop in the comments who do you feel won round one um and i want to uh ensure the panel members are going ahead and doing what you do sending your your scores to mr hawkins privately in our chat here on the panel so that being said i want to definitely say hello to reginald wade corey johnson definitely appreciate you guys pulling up so uh don't be shy drop that stuff in the chat in the chat so while you're getting those out we're going to go ahead and get started with round two so 
round two is actually going to start off with Mr. Frankie Braggadocio first. And this one's actually called Ready Player Two. So here we go. That was tough. That was tough. So Frank, of course, I'm gonna ask if that was some uh if that was some native instruments guitars or is that what okay. Okay. Thought that felt familiar. That's what's up. So round two's kicked off, but it's time for Merc Valentine to respond. And this is actually called Vapor Waves. Here we go. <laughs>
very well done very well done so that concludes round two and as before you know i asked the audience to go ahead and drop your comments who do you think won round two uh panelists of course you know go ahead and slide your slide go ahead and pass your your votes over to mr hawkins um but while we're waiting a moment you got some Merck fans in the audience and you got some Frankie fans in the audience. It could be anybody's bag according to the people's vote. So guys, you guys both did your, your job and you put out some heat. So I'm seeing flames. I'm seeing comments. Uh, yeah, that's what's up. That's what we want. So before we actually enter the final round, we're going to actually ask Mr. Benito Luciano from Way Higher Music to give his comments on the battle so far. Yeah, man, it's been a, uh, it's been what I anticipated. You know, it's uh, amazing to see how much Merck has grown, man, and the veteran Frankie, you know, bringing it like always, man. So I'm um, proud of both of y'all, man. Y'all doing y'all things. Keep it up. I definitely agree. I definitely agree. And I don't know if she's actually available on the mic, but I definitely would like to hear from Miss Asia, the writer herself on her thoughts. She might be watching basketball, y'all. No, I'm, I'm here. I'm just, I'm just cooking. That's all. But hello, everyone. I, I was looking forward to tonight. And like always, y'all have brought it. I'm writing down the beats. I'm I'm listening because I'm like, hmm, can I sing on these? But no, y'all brought it. And uh, especially for Merck, like I hear um, a different sound from you. And I'm I'm like so shocked and so like proud of you. So great job to both of y'all. And you're not the only one. Uh, definitely see some of the comments out here in the audience uh, talking about they might need that Vapor Waves to sing on. So... You better snatch them up quick, but we're going to go ahead and move into the final round and round three is actually going to start with Merck Valentine uh, called High Fidelity. So here we go.
I'm gonna let that one breathe for a second. Okay. All right. Here we go. So those of you out there and those who watch later, please make sure that you follow, like, subscribe, and share the DPU content, no matter which platform you're on. And right now we've got people on Twitch, Facebook, and YouTube right now. Definitely appreciate you guys stopping through and leaving your comments. It's showing love to the crew. So, man. This is tough. This is tough. I mean, even for me, and I'm glad I actually don't get to vote because, uh, man, it may come down to that. But like I said, drop in the chat who you think is actually, uh, you know, who you feeling for the round. So we're going to play the last song for the third round. And it's actually by Frankie Braggadocio called Woke Up and Chose Violence. Here we go. Now for something completely different. Okay. Um, <laughs> please get your scores in to Mr. Deliberate uh, if you have not done so already. That was that was wow. A lot of a lot going on in that track. A lot going on in that track. You would think that you had it pegged, and then it switch, and then it switch again. Um, good transitions. That's that was dope. That was dope, Frankie. Good job. So. The audience 
it's on you guys. So drop in the comments. Who do you think won that round? So QT, what do you got to say about these guys, man? I mean, you you've heard all the tracks. You've seen what they you know kind of work they put in. What do you got to say? I uh, it's really nice to see producers, you know, from a month ago or two months ago, and then now, like to see both of them like doing something. You could tell it's them, but you could tell I like evolving into something crazy. And I wanna. I heard I heard a dope dope beat tonight that really caught my eye. I'm not gonna say who it's from, but I'm just saying I'm just saying, man. It's it's cool to see the, uh, when producers evolve like that, you know, from good to even better and even better. That's crazy. It makes me want to get better too. I mean, that's the goal for all of us, for all of us. Yeah. So, see me, you beats. What you got, man? I mean, <laughs> I know you're going to the next. You're going pretty soon, not next week, but uh, you're coming up. What do you what do you got to say about the guy's performance tonight? The guy's performance proved that I don't want to lose because if I have to face one of them <laughs> losing, that's going to be a hard day. Um, nah, they both bring it, you know, to the umpteenth and uh, looks like I'm going to have to go back to the drawing board and start learning something new because these guys stepped it up real big and uh, I'm proud of both of them. Likewise, likewise. And, uh, Man, when I tell y'all, and I know I say it every time I hear Merck put something new out and I hear Frankie put something different out, that I am so proud that these guys, you know, rock with us, um, not dissing any other crew or any other organization or any other producer for that matter. But, you know, it's different when you actually start, you know, with the team and that you watch that team grow and flourish like we have. It's a beautiful thing. I mean, it's a beautiful thing because we're all there to cheer each other on. Um, I'm actually going to slide over to DJ Clientele for some comments for tonight. What you got, Clientele? Man, it was entertaining. I, I could hear the time and work that they put in. You know what I'm saying? Coming uh, different, not sounding redundant at all, and just kept it spicy. And, you know what I'm saying, we just appreciate both of you guys' hard work. We definitely um, are entertained. Okay. And I, as am I, and apparently the audience is as well. Cause like I said, they, they drop in these comments. So hopefully you guys are actually log in actually seeing what's being dropped in these comments for the show. Um, but without further ado, Mr. Deliberate is ready. So sir, the floor is yours. What a great, uh, performance fellas. Y'all are amazing. Um, don't keep y'all too long. I came down to being a tie except uh, he told me to go to total votes. Uh, the difference in the total votes is one. And our winner is Mr. Valentine Merck. Good job. Good job, Merck. You came in, you understood the assignment. I mean, and you had a you had a dope teacher and you know, mentor, you know. I know Frankie's probably like, man, I shouldn't have bought him that machine last week, but, uh, but nah, I, I hats off to you both. You guys both put up a great fight as far as, you know, the, the battle's concerned, but we all know it's in love. It's in house fighting. So, um, man, but one vote difference, one vote difference. That's tight, but congratulations to Merck. Congratulations to Frankie. Cause, uh, <laughs> guess what? They're both higher in our community group. So. Nobody really loses. And for those who actually uh, wanted to, you know, cop some of those beats, definitely hit us up and we'll let you know what to do to get in contact with either one of these producers. But that is the show for this evening. We definitely thank everyone for coming out and rocking with us, participating with us. And, uh, you know, we can't do it without you guys. So, like I said, keep like following, sharing and spreading the word about DPU. And uh, we'll make sure we keep showing love to you guys with bigger and better shows um, next week. You don't want to miss it. It's a challenge week and titled Your Best Song. So join us next week, Sunday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm Keith from Shine Bright Productions with DPU Family here in the house. 
want to say thank you and good night. Peace.